hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and i'm nasha faces so guys i know it's been a while so yeah i'm back nasha faces so guys uh i know i've neglected you a lot for a long time i think it's been five months four months but i'm back and there's one video i have to tell you about after i think i'll upload it before or after this video i bought a new phone this one uh techno is it techno 19 it's gold it has its pros and it has its it has its pros and it has its cons i think i'll upload this video of buying this phone and unboxing it before or after if it's i did it before how do you like it how it is and if i do it after then uh, i think you'll see it and then i think i'll talk about this phone in depth because i think i've been having it for the last since it launched so when it launches of how much two months one month i don't know but yeah it's serving purposes but today's we don't talk about this phone we are not talking about me being uh my we are talking about makeup uh how do you charge your prices uh for upcoming makeup artists uh how do you go about it uh i've got this i've been got this question for my clients and also i don't know if you saw a collab with mommy francis oh that woman is that lady Alice i love you mommy good job you made me laugh you and she's a whole of a joy and thank you for hosting me on your channel if you're watching this thank you you are so big heart big heart to you so guys uh, i want to talk more in depth we talk with this uh, we talk this more with mama francis now i'll talk about me as a makeup artist in this industry so guys as a makeup artist uh when you want to be a makeup artist these are the things um, i want to talk about my experience i moved uh i'm from coast mombasa i moved 2018 uh the uh early 2018 to nairobi knowing i want to do makeup that's one thing you have to know with makeup is not waking up and saying i want to be a makeup artist with makeup is like you have to have the passion it the passion that uh, you have to have the talent can be taught but if you have the talent good you can be taught to do it but also you have to have the uh, the passion uh the inspiration you want to be uh what you want to what uh what you want to impact or what you want to uh add in in the makeup uh in the makeup so i want to talk all about those things what i've learned what i've experienced what i want you to to not to be con or, or, or not what to miss the mistake you, you are not supposed to do but you'll do them that's how you learn so for me uh starting 2018 i knew i want to do makeup but i had that the little how do i say this i didn't i it was not perfect i can't say everybody's perfect even now i'm not perfect so uh for me makeup uh when i said i want to be a makeup artist uh i came to nairobi it came with a class uh if uh, anybody was on olivia the teens pro makeup artist master class it was 40k yeah it was 40k and girl uh when i came to nairobi my mom gave me only 50k just to go by because you can't stay at somebody's place and then now ask for fair those things you go by but for me with leap of faith i said i want to go to this class i want to pay for this class because uh, that class has taken me far and i don't regret paying for that class it was 40k and i closed my eyes and i prayed to my other like i want to do this class i know i want to be a makeup artist full time and i know it will give me my returns all i paid and i was remaining with 10k that 10k is something now i had to work on like not give that 40k have to make me bring my back my returns but the good thing about this before i came to nairobi i had already 
bought a makeup kit uh i bought a ring lights because i knew when you vision you want to do a makeup be a makeup art makeup artist be please plan even especially if you are on your own but if your family is helping you don't say school fees only when you tell parents or the guardian school fees my dear now the products coming back coming back to buy that asking them again now it's you know it's not it was not on their budget just say i want to do me uh, whatever class you're going to take with which teacher just tell them uh how much is the cause they'll tell you and if i want to pro buy products how much is the product they'll tell you go to your parents or your guardian talk to them uh please i want to do this and for the school fees is this amount and for the products is this amount because uh if they tell you why you do you want to buy products like this after you finish school you have learned the basics if you learn the basics and you don't practice practice make improvement not perfection you improve every single day like for me i always say i'm not perfect i improve every day i improve myself every day uh, teaching students is improvement is practicing doing class makeup is practicing doing brides makeup is practicing me doing research looking video that's practicing everything is practicing and i'm improving myself to make myself better on this industry so when you tell your guide and your garden i want this money to buy backup products and this money for buying products like my um, mommy or daddy or uncle or whatever person i need products so that i can practice so that i can improve myself i can't do this uh the product with the with the studio they still provide the products for you to train but i if i come home i don't have anything to practice on so how can i perfect myself or improve myself so i need this and this for me to buy and to practice to improve myself so tell them the amount the full amount so that they can pay it by the time you're finishing because you also have your product so that you can practice at home that's one thing so that's that thing is you have the pro the products you have your uh, your finish your course from there which how do you go on about it instagram facebook social media tiktok those are your many your social media which are friendly for beginners to market yourself you come to nasha faces you learn after that you're not a makeup artist because nobody knows you only your teacher knows you but she wants your clients to know you or any stranger to know so and so is doing makeup so that's what uh, that's how it comes in so please uh, uh open an instagram page business page so that you can promote it uh open a uh, facebook page open um tiktok do if you're a if you're a person like me god thank god i've got the urge or the confidence to be on front of the camera i i was scared when i started i was scared i was never very confident of me being in front of a camera but i thank god these days i am courageous and confident to be in front of the camera so if you are courageous do your face show your face uh do makeup do eyebrows that's uh, do an eyebrows tutorial and post it somebody see it like oh you do makeup yeah tell your friends or your sister or your cousin or your neighbor your neighbor come please can i do your makeup do your do her makeup post it after that promote 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 promotion i know people say promotion doesn't give give in the chance yeah it doesn't give in the chance if you only have two photos but if you do like 20 contents 20, that's 20 posts and then you promote that page people will be clicking to your profile they'll see that work and they'll book you imagine a post uh, you have done a post for uh, for six days that's uh, 30k and then from there you have gotten five clients that's like uh to let's say the mi minimum charge is to five two five times uh times two five times five that's twelve thousand five hundred you've got a return and apart from that you get followers 
and your word your name is out there because that post will be saved and if somebody saved that post it means that they are interested in your work and in the future they will come back at your post and call you so those are the things that you start with also you can now the those things now you go for salons you, do, you be a makeup artist on, on a salon or you do be a makeup artist on a studio photography studio or you be a makeup artist and as somebody those are also something you grow with then you do makeup and then after that i'm a makeup artist i go home and sleep girl where's the makeup artist kudangani makeup artist you work every single day every like i'm researching what's in what's out what's in what's out after that now let's go and talk about pricing pricing guys pricing 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 please don't be in a rush so that you want to get clients so that you start charging 500 1000 please guys so uh, i says i was talking about pricing for pricing guys for starters uh for starters i always say please charge to five that's my opinion that's what i tell my students if i have a student in this house watching this video please comment if i'm lying i will sell them charge to five if it's one person but if now you get more than four or five then if it's a, a team then you can do a discount you can charge them 2k per person but if they're all of them not now agreeing is 2k and then you go there get two people if you get two people then to tell them that's not the amount you agreed on then you have to at least to charge to five uh, you tell them to five per person but if you go there and just find them there are four people or five people now you can charge them they, um, they discount you talk about because of uh let me talk about the products now uh you are in the industry now like i've realized super stay the maybe lane super stay is 2k the, the from it was from 1800 now it's 2k you see even the products are increasing if the products are increasing why is our makeup price is not increasing why is sick are you stick on that same amount and let's say if it's me if it's me for the bottle uh let me talk about uh, this bottle this one was like uh, 1500 1100 uh, 500 now it's 1600 or 1600 uh, 1600 or 1600 it depends with, uh, with the shop but i know it's going up even the super stay most not even super stay, most of the products all the stock products i know they're going up so if their products are going up why are the prices not going up because if you don't go, um, up, upgrade your prices, now we are the one making a loss. So imagine you are you are in a rental. You have to pay rent. You have to eat. You have to save. You have to dress. You have to go and party. And also you now you have to build up. And any money you have been paid, it has it has to go back to the kids. So tell me, how are you going to do do that if you don't save? And now after you are doing all this, and then you are buy, buy you, are, you are doing makeup for one thousand, one thousand two hundred. And I know those who are doing one thousand makeup or five hundred makeup, you are buying makeup from the Du Bois. I uh, I always say for clients, your skin is everything. Your health is everything please uh if you're doing one uh, other kind of makeup okay uh i won't talk bad about it but make sure if you, if you have any anything happen to your skin don't go and complain because you know a uh, makeup pro makeup uh less than two five there's something wrong with those products because if somebody is doing makeup for you original products they won't charge you less than that because the products are so damn expensive so for my my upcoming makeup artists please don't go beyond two five and if they you are doing a discount because there are not many people don't go beyond 2k 
and for bridal uh i always say pro bridal charge if you're doing a trial please charge because you're using products and you, you are doing your time and if for the day of the makeup please also charge because uh also you're using products so for where you are going to charge there i can say uh that's my opinion like you can charge from 5k to 6k with trial not less than that and please don't be envious of other makeup artists do you compete with you and you will grow because if you see somebody uh she's parting she's every day doing makeup no, no, no. you don't know her situation and you don't know how she go about it and you don't know even maybe she's doing makeup for free everybody no so tell me are you going to be uh competing with her just compete with you for me i never compete with anybody i compete with myself i want to improve myself or oh, what i did uh what is what i did this year i won't do next year i will improve and whatever i did miss the mistake of this year i will improve on next year and whatever loopholes i had i'll make sure i'm fixing them or how how i go about it and for weddings now please uh, another thing please don't forget please have a contract uh please a uh, well written contract and well signed please uh because that will help you the clients will be will feel self and for you makeup artists you'll be safe and confident i book this bride that means being paid 50 percent of the deposit signed contract and that's when you say yeah your books are bright and also now there's this motion like um i have my i have my foundation uh, i have my products can you come and do my makeup but at a lesser price no there's no something like that please why uh you're using your products because you want to feel comfort i want to give you comfort to be confident while you're wearing the makeup you are paying for my services you are paying for my talent you are paying for my time if you don't you feel bad uh, me using your products and still paying the full amount then let me use my products because my products are original they may be different brands but they're same brands and they look good because you came to my page and you saw my work and you fell in love with my work then it means you paying for my talent my services and what i'm doing for me using your product is just me giving you that confidence all the all the confidence of me of you being comfortable with your products and also the case there's no simple glam yeah there is a simple glam but simple glam are more how do I say they're more complicated than full glam? With full glam, you know it's full coverage, contour, everything. Yeah, but now for for simple glam, now it's where now I come with te technique like everything simple, 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 simple. And at the end of the day, you have wear makeup, but it's still your face. So simple glam, full glam, the prices are all more of the same. And for now, if you, somebody will come and as what about professional makeup artists, those who are in the industry, those who have grown, uh, like if you are in the industry for more than three years, if you are a professional makeup artist, if you have been doing it regularly, every day, every, every day, every night, you are a professional makeup artist. For you now, you are building your prices. Now you see, like if you started for me two five. For you increasing prices you know it's easier than somebody who has done 5k for please increase your prices while you continue every yearly or if you do yearly or one year and a half or two year two years please increase your price because every every year the prices are going up the tax is going up so also you you have to go up so increasing prices from 25 to 35 is easy increasing prices for bridal from 6k 
to 8k or 9k is very easy but increasing prices from 1000 to, to 5 that's so hard that's why i was saying when you start being a makeup artist don't run to buy fake products run to buy original products that will give you the confidence of you now charging what you want to charge your worth your everything and then if you are freelance you know you always have to include and tell the clients i'm a freelancer you have to pay for my transport to and for it's either it's uber matachu but i always say uber because you are carrying a heavy kit and if you are a profession still uber because me i do uber but i always say if you are you have your a place like me i have a place i'm located view park towers 20th floor five please come at the at the studio it's cheaper because uh, I always um uh, I have a studio, so if you book early enough, it's easier for you to get a studio session with me, and I uh, am full time as long as you're not late. Because if you are late, uh, those are other things I'll talk about. Uh, but for house call, you know, for house call, I always say it uh it will be more money, and then you pay for somebody uh, pay for my Uber two and four because uh, how I calculate this, I'm on the road for two hours why uh me coming to your place it may take 30 minutes to 45 minutes i come there i, I do uh, i set up my station i do a makeup for 30 minutes to 45 minutes and then i wrap everything up and then i set and then i set my and then i come back again that's like roughly let me not like just two to two, two hours and 30 minutes so i would like if i'm at the studio especially on the weekend i could have done three people max is three people a special weekend and especially on the busy days i could do three people that's why uh, i always say if you are I, I have a station uh a studio i always advise them to come at my station because it's easier for me and it's cheaper for, for cheaper for them and easier for me but if i come to you it's a bit expensive to you because i am patterning all these things i know i'm not i won't charge you the three people but i'll charge you not the same price as the studio but also i'll charge you my transportation for going and coming back So, like me coming to your house is like a leisure for you because you are to feel comfortable, you are to feel uh, secure in your space, everything is familiar with you. I'll do that, but it costs more. And also now, for uh, make sure now when everybody's booking, they book with a deposit. Either you said I a deposit of 50% of what you are charging, 30%, whatever, as long as there's a commitment a commitment makes you to be assured that client will come if there's no commitment then you won't be sure because a client can cancel anytime imagine a client made a commitment but didn't didn't pay the deposit and then that they can um i won't be available i can come and then there's another client who was serious want to come but you cancel because you told her you are waiting for another client so imagine you miss two you miss her and you miss the other one where if she had not booked, she has booked, even if she has uh, didn't come, you, that deposit may comfort you to say, I didn't, at least I didn't lose something. So those are the things I want to talk about. We'll talk more uh, because I don't want this video to be long and then you guys to be bored with me. So those are the things I want you to think about. And then I'll, in future, while we are, if we are, I'm recording these videos, we'll be talking more. I'll, I'll, I'll write down something well, uh, how to explain how to go about it, how to do a, a, a bridal contract, all those things i will write them down and then we talk more but if you want a more depth video please go and uh, watch mama mama francis and my collabo video i'll put it on my link we have talked about this more in depth so please enjoy and please guys if you're here please don't forget to subscribe uh like the com like the video ring that notification bell so that you'll be the first person to watch my video and guys i think i'm back now no i think yeah i'm definitely confident i'm back 
I want it to get lost again. Uh, I was there were some things uh, in my in my personal things, so I can't talk about them. Maybe I'll talk them in future, but. I was going some rough time but now i'm back so i hope so this video helps um i miss you i hope so you miss me too so thank you oh and one last thing um about the house guys about the house i did a video on in this video in on my youtube channel that house aki guys i know you send me you, you dm me every day but that house aki is full is sold out and if somebody uh moves out there's a queue i think there's a a way like that house is in demand let me know like that house is beautiful i love that house myself but there's a demand so even if you dm me i'll just connect you i i, I always only whoever dm me i always answer I'll connect you to the person in charge of that house. So, but me, my honest opinion, that house is always full. And if somebody is leaving, it's always, there's somebody waiting. There's a waiting list. But if you want, DM me, I'll send you the number of the person in charge. You talk to her. If she want to be on the wait list, okay. So, yeah. Bye. Have a lovely day or night uh please don't forget to subscribe thank you